They manufactured the replacement components. They have a staff of supervisors, engineers, and technicians on site. Uh, they're the ones who subcontracted with National Welding to do the welding of the steel. Uh, they're the ones who subcontracted with Mamouet. This big red piece of equipment that does the heavy lifts, they subcontracted to have that work done. They've subcontracted with in-place machining, uh, machining to do all of the machining to the TBM components. They subcontracted with Gearworks to um, go ahead and, and look at the gearboxes in the uh, cutter drive motors. And what we agreed early on with Hitachi Zosen was that we do this as a joint effort. STP would do the types of things that they typically do. Hitachi Zosen would do the activities that they typically perform. So the construction of the shaft was something that was done by STP, but all of the the bulk of the work associated with the repairs is being done by Hitachi Zosen. We provide labor to Hitachi Zosen uh, in connection with performing those repairs. We provide assistance, uh, equipment support, things of that nature. But there's a, there's a division of work between STP and Hitachi Zosen. We're both here. We're both fully committed to the repair process and doing our part to make that successful. Once the TBM resumes tunneling, Hitachi Zosen will still have people here on site as the uh, tunneling progresses towards the North Portal. So they're very, very involved.